Hello and welcome to Shadowrun Dragonfall, the director's cut. Let's specifically choose the direct, uh, oh, the Dragonfall DLC, which made it into a standalone, new standalone version. I don't understand really, but I got this game gifted, so let's jump right into it. Uh, I previously I, pl I played the Shadowrun version before this one, so. This is how the game manages its DLC and add-ons and stuff. Shadowrun Dragonfall, Director's Cut. Let's go! Oh, okay. Uh, create your character. Um, uh, I think I know this. That's... I'm not really the meta human type in Shadowrun, except for maybe uh, elves. But let's take something familiar. Uh, humans. Street Sam, Mage, Decker, Shaman, Rigor, Physical Adept. Take a Mage. Okay, I can choose. Yeah. Archetypes. Uh, I like to choose some not so typical hairstyle. Auto. Oh, okay. Okay, the last time I played this is really. Year over hairstyle. Nah. Something more conservative. Or a mage. Wait, I can't. Oh, okay, I can't play shaman. Uh, I'm okay, let's take that. Horns? Do I need horns? No. Fear. Yeah, that this will strike fear into my uh, into the hearts of my enemies. White. No, no. Let's take white. Uh, yeah, all white-haired mage. Da -da -da. Continue to stats. Let's go. Spend your karma. Uh, okay, I need as a mage and intelligence. The pen and paper. This time, will of power, magical attacks, and bam. bam. What? Yeah, I guess that's kind of cheaper. And range combat, I like. Let's try to dodge attacks at the beginning. Rifle tank. Okay, shotgun or SMG. I like. Bridge combat, strength, I don't need that. And we need definitely that. Okay, shoes and etiquette. Okay. No, 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 no. Etiquette is about knowing how you behave in very social situations. The right etiquette can give you an edge in certain conversations. Like in the base game. Okay, I. Uh, I'm a mage from the streets! No, I'm a security, former security mage. When is your street name? Okay, let's take something no one would expect from me. With a big M. That's right. <laughs> The 
Caulfield Manoran. Life was good, easy jobs, regular pay, reliable, reliable, reliable crew. Things went south, and you had to drop off the grid. Put a bullet into in the past, start fresh somewhere new. Promise of opportunity and anonymity draws you to the free city of Berlin, the flux state. Uh, isn't it? And the Shadron Pen and Paper University, an, an, an Ecri state? This is Berlin, Germany, right? Okay. Uh, Grand Social Experiment and Social Order. Corporations, three carefully here. Even the great dragon Lufio only has so much sway in the constantly involving power structure of Berlin. The perfect place for a savvy Shadowrunner to disappear and begin anew. And, as luck would have it, home to your old partner in crime, Monica Schaffer. Uh, it's your third run with Monica and her team, an old castle hold first, one hour east of Berlin. Birds on a hill overlooking the countryside. The job is standard uh, smash and grab. Crack the vault, grab the data, get out in one piece. A mediocre payday, but work is work. As the team gathers from Monica's pre-run briefing, you pause to take in your surroundings. Alfred Manor, 2054. The estate grounds are silent, save for the faint whistling of the wind. Your team gathers near a side entrance. To the old castle hold fast, cloaked in darkness, the night is peaceful. You know it won't last. You know it for what it is. A pleasant illusion that will shatter at the sound of the first gunshot. Monica. Loosen up, folks. Monica Schäfer, you ran with her uh, back in the day. Watched her get her first data jack. Now she's uh, your team leader and a deck hot decker to boot. We're on a tight timetable. I want to enter the estate, find the basement, open the data vault, extract the fires, and both. Ten minutes, top to bottom. Dietrich. Okay. Uh, trying to get home in time for worm talk, love. Dietrich, shaman, the old man of the team. He smiles at her. His facial tattoos uh, withering in the moonlight. Monica's eyes twinkle with mischief. Maybe? How many times have I told you, you can't trust anything that comes out of a dragon's mouth. That tr trash will rot your brain. She grins. That's occasional. Besides, this should be a milk run. Security is supposed to be light. A few automatic weapons, no armor. With a little luck, they'll never know we were here. Yeah, I'm, I'm a hardened street, no, former security mage. In my experience, there's no such thing as a milk run. Except to the milkman. That's a milk run. Words of wisdom from a new edition. I agree with Space Wingman. Glory, razor clawed street samurai. Her voice is cold and neutral, her expression pleasant. They may only be private security, but the bullets don't know that. I can patch you up if I have to, but I'd rather not have to. You people need to relax. We're professionals, remember? Monica raises her arm and speaks into her wrist-mounted comlink. A darkened face shimmers on the view screens. Iger, are you in position? Iger. The comlink crackles, and the response comes back low and soft. Softer than you'd expect from a troll. Affirmative. The alarm lines have been cut, and I have a clear line of fire on the estate's service entrance. When you exit the building, the path will be clear. Excellent. Thank you, Iger. Just doing my job. Iger out. Come and goes dark. Monica winks at uh, you as she drops her arm. See? We're professionals. <laughs> Alright, people. Enough chatter. Our client wants the data from the vault, so we get him the data from the vault. Quick, quiet, and quick. Dietrich, you said quick twice. Worm talk is on tonight. Glory raises an eyebrow slightly. I told you, it's educational. Get your stuff. We'll head in. Your gear, some weapons, and grab a weapon. Grab the rest. Uh, uh, let's take a weapon. Take a rifle. 
Grab the rest of your kit. Power bolt, mana bolt. Keep the van. Follow them. Didn't we sneak up? Security is really tight here. Okay, I go in. Shotgun! <laughs> First objective clear. Why do I have to be the guy in the front? I'm not the street Sam. Private museum. The owner of your estate must have money to burn. Ah, that's variety of remarkably well preserved Slavic artifacts. A complete skeleton of a ter terapod dinosaur. Huh? It appears to be genuine. I mean, I don't think the rich guy would put in some plastic bones into his. This va uh, the vase of, in this case looks. Both very old and very variable. A fine scroll work of lapis and gold leaf decorates its interior, and the interior shimmers with the organic beauty of abalone shell. Your fixer could probably move this thing in a heartbeat. You can't help but notice that the glass enclosing looks awfully flimsy. Uh, one thing you learn when you were on the run: don't deviate from the mission. Only lead to problems. Oh, the castle display case is decorated with the inlet panels of ivory sims raw. Yeah, let me let me take the bullets for you, team. I said the elevator should be to the north. I don't have a compass here. But this this seems to be north. No. Intruders at my position! Fire it up! Initiative! Yeah, I know what... I think I know what I got to do. Oh, we have a shaman. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. That's name shot. Line of sight locked. Critical 50%. This, of course. And our street sand. Let's go over here. Why not? Ooh. Maybe we can. Okay, uh, let's give her a power bolt. One down. Okay, enemies. Come at me. Oh shit, they have a troll. Okay, this is not your average security detail. Monica. Da -na -na -na. Okay, let's. No one has grenades. Okay, she has grenades. Uh, here to go. Okay, let's take this guy. Okay, uh yeah, an area effect would be would be nice. Mm. Okay, it's all friends, okay. Man, I feel totally forgot about all the awesome uh, uh, spells this game offers. Hmm. Okay. Let's do something else. Ah, oh, damn, he has no guns.
Hmm. Of course. Okay, let's get over here. Uh, oh man, this is a close combat. Treat Sam. Mana bow. No, let's do something else. Okay, let's rush them. Okay, he's not dead. I watched this. Oh, they're coming from behind! Ha! Lousy shot. Okay, I take it back. Those are just random dudes. Okay, no, they are not. Uh. Ouch! I'm the goddamn space ring man. Why are you shooting at me? How about some AOE? Oh come on, he missed. How about a grenade? Oh come on, you missed. Okay. You want it? Are you shitting me? Okay, if you miss, I will never talk to you again. 83... Eight. Okay, they are unbalanced. At least something. Whoa! Okay. The guys are dying here! Of course he heals. Of course he throws a grenade. Uh, okay. This guy should go over... Should heal himself. Okay. Which one? 69, 99... Let's take him out. Nice. Aiming. Uh, light cover unbalanced. Very good. Damn. I should take the shot and, of course, this is. Ah, I can't come right! Ah! No! Don't die! There's nothing! Nice! Killing their own guys! Okay. Uh, okay, let's clear up the road, I guess. What can you do? 88% Okay, he's down 39 hmm. Then I have a better idea Jump to this guy And then... Heal Okay, then you are in 39% Maybe I should Okay 48 45 I'm risking it And it paid off Six damage 59 Okay Magic wins. And I missed. Okay. This is not looking bad. Uh, it's all friends within a 300 would 
incoming damage reduced. Okay. Wait. Overwatch. Oh no, I can't. Damn. So if he, I mean, Overwatch is when you uh, position a guy somewhere and he automatically reacts to movement or other enemies attacks uh so basically can row oh 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 doesn't matter 58 let's try it oh of course Okay, it is on. Okay, let's... 47. Okay, let's just rush this mage over here. anything. Okay, 51. Yeah, this is not good enough. Of course you miss. 65% maybe? Maybe I should take... Oh, 99%. Awesome. Alle damage! Ah. Ah. I survived this. Okay, let's be bold. Hi, friend! In your face! 51. 22. Okay, let's try it from. No, let's move. Move away. For the guy. And my back comes to... Sixty-three, okay, let's try that. Got him! Give him some electro core. Percent. Hmm. Okay! Make him faster. Let's move up to this point and okay, thirty-seven percent. Yeah, that doesn't cut it. Let's try it anyway. Aha, uh -huh, missed. And another bolt. Okay, near death. Okay, let's run over here. 83. Nice. How about an aim shot? 80%. And nice. We got this. But we have to reload. How about I'm getting you to safety? And that's it. Now what I should actually risk that. This guy should really run away. 3%. Hmm. Sixteen. Ah, this will not work. Whoa! 
Okay, that was luck. That was a good knife throw. Yeah, we massacred them. Nice. Uh, I mean, uh, we had no choice. They attacked us. Go to the elevator. Of course. Let's go up. The half eight manor run. So far, so good. If you skirmish with the security set of any alarms, you don't hear them. Monica leads the rest of the team downward into the basement of the Harfeld Manor. Your payday is waiting. The data vault lies ahead. Come on, this smells like a trap. Dietrich. Dietrich eyes the door, then turns to Monica. That's a big freaking walk, Liebchen. Oh shit, he's right. <laughs> Bigger than, <laughs> than on the schematic. Schematic didn't have a date. Our client may have old intel. Still, our instructions were clear. The data we're looking for should be just on the other side of this door. Monica comes a hand through her hair, parting it to the, uh, reveal the black plastic snitch of her data jack. Quick jaunt into the matrix, a little digital hand waving, and I'll have this thing wide open. Be right back. First of static crackles through the tiny speaker on Monica's comlink. Iger, still in position outside the estate. Hold on, Monica. Who's in charge? While you're jacked in. Monica Rosalize Dietrich fixes her stare uh, identically on the vault door. Chloe looks cold and distant, just as she always does. We've been through this before, Iger. You are not in the KSK anymore. And that chain of command nonsense doesn't fly in the shadows. We don't need rules and regulations to guide us, the same principles that apply to the flux state. Please, spare me the lecture, your politics have nothing to do with this. Best get used to it, I go love. She sighs. Look, it's a simple question, years of experience tell me that it needs an answer. I guess right, Monica, uh, we have a second in command, just in case. Okay, I agree with Dietrich, if someone needs to take charge, it will happen. We don't have time for this, Iger. We have to uh, a job to do. Uh, I'm not actually for discussing this. We have, don't have time for this, Iger. We have a job to do. No one asks you, rookie. Uh -huh. Come on, Monica. Put someone in charge and let's get on with the mission. Monica stares at the screen on her wrist for a moment, clearly irritated. Then that twinkle appears in her eye again. She smiles as at you as she speaks into her comic. Very well, we'll do this one Igor's way. While I'm jacked in, Space Wingman is in charge. There's a pause. Then Igor's voice crackles out of the comics again. Space Wingman, did you did I hear you right? You're putting the rookie in command. Mm, I'm no rookie, Igor, and you know it. You heard what I said, Igor. This is ridiculous. I know that this is a joke to you, Monica, but I'm telling you. Iger. Monica's tone is all business. Evidently, she has heard enough. The decision's made. You have your answer. Without another word, Iger's image figures and fades from Monica's communicator. Sorry about that. Iger can be inflexible, the legacy of a long military career. But she knows what she's doing, and she means well. Um... It's a legitimate concern, actually. As long as you follow the orders and can press what you want, not sweat, I buy a beer and turn. Nah, it's actually a legitimate concern, she hardly knows me. No. There's a thin line between concern and insubordination. You let me know if she crosses it. Uh oh. I smell a double cross. Okay, enough chatter. Let's get this done. Monica turns toward the door, fingers poised on the controls of her cyber deck, then glances back at you with a grin. See you on the other side. Then she punches it, projecting her consciousness into the cyberspace. Got Matrix. Her fingers harmonizing in the smooth rhythmic uh, stack call that only an expert data can achieve. Yeah, let's. Ah! 
Black eyes! Without warning, Monica's back arches violently and her head jacks back, slicing terrible screams. Oops, sorry. Muscle spasms ripple through her face and her jaw snaps shut, sending a mist of blood spraying from between her teeth. You look down to see a nub of pink flesh hit the floor, the tip of her tongue. The room explodes into action. Gloria leaps toward Monica, uh, her hand outstretched to yank the cord from his data jacket. Dietrich surges forward to wrap the team's fallen decker into, uh, in a bear hug, holding her against the convulsions that wreck her body. With Monica's unearthly screams still ringing sharply in your head, you are the only dimly aware of the door slamming shut behind you. Uh, holy shit! Okay, Monica pulled the plug. Okay, this is actually not a... Okay, smash Monica's cyber deck. Help Dietrich hold Monica down. I smashed the cyber deck. The cyber deck was constructed to send a bomb blast, as you as you might. Uh, try as you might. Uh, you can't manage to crack its casing, let alone damage its internal uh, circuitry. While you beat on the deck in vain, Glory manages to yank the cord out of Mag uh, Monica's head. A whiff of oil blue smoke traces its way from a data check into the ceiling. Hey, this is not standard standardized uh, Shadowrun equipment. I mean, Decker equipment. This is what why this is what happens when you don't have any decking skills. Uh, the coming last sense of charred meat and ozone fill the air. You've seen the effects of biofeedback before, but nothing like this. Oh, sabotage! Suddenly, Monica's eyes, uh, Monica's eyes flutter open. Muscle tremors continue to distort her face, and blood oozes between her lips. Oh shit! You see the muscles in her jaw tensing and the look of con uh, concentration in her eyes. She's struggling to speak. Yeah, I don't have biotech, just... Okay, what is she trying to say? Slowly, painfully, Monica wrestles her jaw open. The blood welled up in her mouth comes powering out in a slick covering her chest. She expels a thick, guttural sound that might be a word. Satisfied? She closes her eyes and forces her mouth to make the shapes she needs. Fear, fear. With an effort, Monica opens her eyes again and meets yours. You see pain and fear in her gaze, and something else. Oh. Boy, a shrink. A sudden spasm jerks Monica's head back, uh, head back again. She grunts, then her chin drops to her chest and her head lolls uh, to one side. Her eyes fix on an object in the next room, computer terminal. The soft light of a cursor blinks uh, on its uh, recessed screen. Slowly, she attempts to speak again, but the only sound that emerges is a long, strangled croak. A look of resignation washes uh, over Monica's face and she stops fighting. The gore sli uh, slick jaw goes slack, and she dies. No! You killed her! You will pay for this! Hmm. Okay. Take those dudes out. I don't know who's who's to blame for this, but damn, he has shitty aim. It. Wait, he had Overwatch on? At least they're lousy shots. I missed by 96%. Come on.
Okay, we got him down. Oh, come on! Uh, 65%. Okay, let's get direct uh, line of fire. Now we're active. Terminal. MC post building maintenance software ver version 1.01. .01. Command line interface. Internal memory checks some invalid. Deary, this tunnel is printing your name out over and over again. Space Wingman, better get over here. Deary scans the room nervously. They've sealed the door behind us. We've got to find another way out of here. What are you doing? Money was trying to tell me something about this tunnel. Must be important. Well, any idea? Something tells me we're going to have more company soon. Okay, stay frosty, Dietrich. Just give me a minute. X continues to scroll down the terminal screen. Problem has been detected with the core component of the MC pass. Restore MC pass to factory default settings? Yes, no. Warning. Restore will take several minutes to execute. Connected doors and peripheral will be disarmed and when complete. Okay. Processing request. 0% complete. As you watch the number on the screen slowly begins to climb, this is going to take a while. You glance down at the second screen to see that the facility is on high alert. In place of a simple uh, data vault, it seems you've stumbled upon some kind of massive underground complex. Okay, this blew up in our faces. A map of the Hope Fast grounds indicates that the security forces are en route from multiple angles. The door is currently being rebooted by the system's restore process of flashing a dull red. If you're reading this display correctly, the only access from this room is the Hope Fast Old Servants entrance on the western side of the building. At that moment, Iger's image winks onto your comlink with a cracking sound. The image is grainy, flickering in and out. What's going on down there, rookie? Hey? Talk to me! Iger, new extraction point. Hold up, where's Monica? Uh, wait, are we sure she's really dead? I mean, this is a shadow run. Uh, okay, I'm sorry. Iger, Monica didn't make it. Uh, okay, let's be... I need to keep... Down! We're keeping... Okay, let's keep it professional. Iger silence is thick, but when she's finally responds, her tone is professional. Roger that! She cuts out without another word. Glory turns to, uh, to face you, her movement smooth and robotic. Her voice comes out in a frosty monotone. What's the play, Space Wing Man? Well, uh, Space... Uh, Shadowrun. Uh, okay, that was bad. Uh, our escape will open in a minute. We hold until then. I say we kill every jacket who enters this room. How does that sound? Monica found a way to open the doors, but it's going to take us some time. Okay, our escape room will open in a minute. We hold tight until then. By hold tight, you mean you sit here and fry anyone who comes through the door, don't you? Ah, pretty much here. Yeah. His painted expression twists into a mask of hate. His hands begin to glow at prime energy. I can do that. Good. We'll let them find. Now let's find some cover and wait for the door uh, locks to disarm. Okay, um... Are there any... It's coming from here? I don't know. Oh. Shouldn't I... I can summon a spirit? Okay, maybe we can use that. Try to summon a spirit. And... Keep the thing alive. Oh, maybe that's a good opportunity to save the game. 
Okay. Can't go to Overwatch. Wind Dancer. Okay, let's make him the. Uh, I would like to say Fall Guy. Reload. Why can I not? Whatever, man. Okay, there's no. Damn. Okay, let's go over here. Here they come! Damn, Riga! Okay. So I should actually heal myself. Nice. Magic. Let's try it, maybe? Nice! Got him down. One turn. And aim. Uh, no wound to heal, okay. No, 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 what is he doing? Game chance. Uh... Okay, let's move down here. Maybe he can take some bullets for us. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay. Let's go to the... Lightning Bolt... Electro Current... Uh. Wind Blast... The 8... No, no, we're, we're doing something else. Try to take out the drone and ah. still cannot rotate the map like an XCOM. Okay, like fifty nine. Ooh, that must have hurt. Holy shit. Uh oh. Okay, uh, 99%? Yeah, I'm taking that. Okay, let's heal up. No, 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 what are you doing? Oh, come on! Okay. Nice. Uh, a fresh grenade, because I'm so stupid to... 59. Yes. Okay, let's 
go over here. Okay, let's try to make him an attractive target. No problem. Oh, where did he come from? Ninety-nine percent. Blank block. Oh, come on. Okay, let's go for the direct kill. Okay. 84%. Let's take the 84% then. Next that damage. 8 damage 8, damage 10. The figure looping towards you is big, even for an orc. The majority of uh, his body is shattered in, in a suit of heavy overlapping plates. What you can see on his face looks like raw and slick like or old scar tissue stretched thin over his skull. He wears uh, an expression of supreme confidence. Uh, Cyber zombie boy. Security captain. Alright friends, playtime's over. All you shadowrunners are the same. Skulking, sneaking, steal a vase or two from the museum. No harm, maybe I'll let you scamper away into the night. But now it's too late for that sort of generosity, visitors. And welcome down here. The gapping maw of the minigun jerks upward. The impatient gesture loaded with malice. Drop your weapons and surrender! That's military great armor he's wearing, Space Young Man. Armed against small arms fire. We have a tough time getting through it. I'm less concerned about the armor than I am about that minigun. Those things can tear a man in half. You're three seconds before I open the hose. Step out here and surrender, and I promise I'll make this easy. Mm, no, he he won't. And I'm near death, so something tells me you're gonna kill us either way. True, I can't deny, it, but wouldn't it be easier if you didn't fight back? The orc shrugs, and you hear the distinctive whir of his vindicator's motor spinning up to speed. The barrels begin to blur as he wheels the weapon to face you. Uh, okay. I have to run. And on that's not good. And I have to heal my guy. Okay. It's up to you, man. Uh, let's run over here. Okay, that's lightning bolt. Okay, let's take. Uh, And also minus one AP. Okay, let's take four. Okay, wind blast it is. Are you shitting me? Hey, maybe we should take care of that that guy over there. Get to him. Okay, let's. Seventeen percent. Let's give him. Yeah, I was too greedy. Oh, this guy. This guy is 
fast. Okay. 39. 39. Try that. He isn't near death. Okay, that was sheer luck. Okay, uh, wounded out of sight. Nothing. Can I heal somebody? Do I have stuff? No, you have nothing. Cannot go to Overwatch. Let's end this. The door unlocks with a loud click. Your escape route is clear. Nice. Okay. Uh, another drone. Nice. Okay, let's let's run. Yeah, let's run. There's no reason to fight this dude. <laughs> Asshole! Okay, we have to dispatch, get rid of this guy, but we must reload. Are you shitting me? Holy shit! This guy is fast! Uh, did I only care for myself? I mean, this is Shadowrun. No, let's try to escape. Okay, Dietrich, get out! Damn. Of course! Should have known, Underground Bunker has a ton of guys. Why does he... 41% are you shit? Okay, every man for himself! Those are the shadows. There's no touching. There's loyalty. Only money. And we are under equipped, so yeah, I guess the Sam street Sam has to fight it. Holy shit! Run. Yeah, I'm exiting. Okay, I'm safe. Yeah, we should actually kind of survive this by uh, fleeing. Uh, I mean, tactical retreating. Uh, yeah, I give a shit about the run. I just wanna wanna escape, and this was obviously some kind of trap. Iger, Iger rises from her corpse, uh, strewn perch at your approach. From the look of her on her face, it's obvious that she's already sized up, uh, seized up, the, uh, 
the situation. Language. I know this was going to happen. I fucking knew it. Uh, we can only one For now, we need to bug out. Uh, Monica didn't make it. We barely got out ourselves. Okay. We can talk about this later. For now, we need to bug out. And yes, we need to get out of here. Tell me something I don't know. I just slept the side of the van. Pile in, people and spacing men. When we get back to the uh, Kreutz Bazaar, we're gonna have a little talk. And this is not my fault. So, we got away. Man. Let's see what happens next. I guess uh, we have to lay low now. So. Yep. Yeah.